There's one trick every player in the NBA uses to get by their defender, and that trick is using the off arm. The off arm is used to protect the basketball when dribbling, but it can help players get by their defender too. Many players use the off arm to swipe down on a defender's reaching hand. Not only does this knock down the defender's arm, but it allows the offensive player to gain an advantage. When the defender reaches, he has to lean towards the basketball. If he gets the steal, then he forces a turnover and gets his team a possession. But if he doesn't get it, he is now at a disadvantage. Watch here, as the defender is guarding, he reaches at the ball. The offensive player attacks and swipes down on the reaching arm. Now the defender is out of position to stay in front of the ball handler and he can easily get by. But now watch here, the offensive player doesn't use his off arm and the defender can easily reach by and steal the basketball. But most of the time, the off arm is used to protect the basketball and it can give the ball handler the advantage in this situation as well. Using just the slightest off arm can hold off a defender or prevent him from reaching. Like watch here, as the ball handler attacks, he uses his off arm very slightly, but even this slight use prevents the defender from being able to reach and keeps the defender on his side. And keeping the defender on your side is very important because now the ball handler is in control and the defense cannot reach or cut off the ball handler. Like watch here on the drive, the defender tries to reach, but using the off arm prevents the defender from being able to reach across and steal the ball. Or on this play, the defender cannot cut off the ball handler because the off arm is being used to keep the defender on his side. And it can also be used to keep the defender on your back. Like on this play, the defender gets stuck behind the ball handler and the ball handler uses his back and off arm to take him out of the play and seal him behind. The off arm is a great way to handle pressure since defenders will often press up and try and reach. This once again can hold them off and prevent them from stealing the ball even if they are playing in front. Crossovers are one of the best moves to use in basketball, but it also exposes the ball to the defender. When a move is being made, it's one of the easiest times for the defender to steal the ball. That's why using the off arm protects the ball in these situations. Like watch here, as he makes a move, he uses his off arm to protect the ball and prevent it from being stolen. But it can also be used after the move as well. Plenty of players use their off arm to get into their defender's body on the drive. By doing this, they establish position and it allows them to drive to the rim easily. Watch here, he puts his off arm into the defender's body to initiate contact. This takes the defender out of the play and allows him to get right to the hoop. Using the off arm is something every basketball player does. It is very important for protecting the ball and handling it against pressure. The best players in the NBA all use it. And by using the off arm, they can play with pace and constantly be in control and play at their own speed. So if you would like to see how the best players in the NBA play with pace, click on this video right here.